Hi everyone. Today let us talk on files and folders. Okay, what is a file? A file is an item that contains information for example text or images or music. They are represented with icons to recognize them easily on computers. Let us see a few examples of files with their icons. So the first one from the left is the music icon, the second is the picture icon, third is the video icon, fourth is the dogs icon. What is a folder? A folder is a container where the files can be stored. Let us also visually see how the folder icon looks like. This is the icon of a folder. So as we have seen from the definition, it is a place where all the files are stored. For example, where the music files are stored, where the photo files are stored, where the video files are stored, and where the text files are stored. To create a new folder, let me access my computer. I will double left click it to access my computer. And from the navigation panel, I will choose the desired drive where I want to create a new folder. And we can see the drives in the, in the navigation panel as well as in the right side of the Windows Explorer. Now I'm going to choose the drive F where I want to. As we have now accessed the drive F, I will go to the menu bar and we can see the folder icon. I will single click it and a new folder icon appears with a highlighted blue color. So in that I will give a new name. I will type a new name as new folder as we have finished giving the name i will press enter key there is also another way a shortcut way to create a folder for that we will right click on any white space and then we will drag down the pointer to the new and then folder we we'll click on it and a new folder icon appears with a highlighted blue color for the same process we will give a new name in the blue highlighted area so let us type a name and after finishing typing the name we will press the enter key and thus we have created another new folder we can also rename a folder so now to do that we will single left click it and right click it and we will see many options for that we will drag down the pointer to rename and after clicking the rename we, will, we can give a new name folder folder for me i'll give as my folder my folder one and as soon as we finish giving the name we will press the enter key okay now let us try to open a folder in order to open a folder i will select a folder by single left click and to open a folder i will right click it and we see this open option i'll click it and thus we have opened the folder to delete a file first of all we need to find out where the file is stored for example the file is stored inside this folder we need to access it and then make sure that the pointer is on the file we need to which we need to delete it and right click it and we select the delete option there's the file is already deleted and the deleted file will be in the trash bin we need to open it and there we will find the file which has been deleted deleting a folder is same as deleting a file we need to select the folder which we need to delete it right click it and then we choose the delete option and thus it is already deleted and the deleted folder will also be found in the trash bin we can restore the deleted items from the trash bin. To do that, we go to menu bar, select manage and restore items. Thus, we have already restored the folder which we have deleted recently.